Hi everyone, we are from Huawei Technologies Canada. We are presenting the paper on contextual residue aggregation for ultra high resolution imaging painting. Image in painting is widely used in applications, including adjusting object position, removing unwanted visual elements, and repairing damaged photos. Prior methods for imaging painting can be categorized into three groups. The first group of methods fill the whole region through copying. Examples include patch match and diffusion-based methods. The second group fill the whole region through modeling in a data-driven manner. Examples include pixel iron and a fully convolutional network. The third group combines the two techniques. Examples include deep view and patch swap network. Our proposed method belongs to the third group. Prior learning-based methods are not able to handle high-resolution images because of difficulty of training, limitation of GPU memory, and the lack of high-resolution training data. Our method is proposed specifically to tackle this issue. Let's see how it works. In phase one, given a raw input image of any size, we simply downsample it to a low resolution image which has size of 512 by 512. We then fit the low resolution image and mask to the generator. The generator is a course to find your network that can get the image painted in an end to end manner. In phase two, we subtract the raw input image with its blurred version to get a contextual residue map. We then aggregate the contextual residues to obtain the residues for the whole region. In phase 3, we ensemble the low resolution in painting result to obtain high resolution blurry result. We then add the aggregated residues to the blurry result to get a sharp result. As shown, the generator is the only trainable component in the whole pipeline. It only operates on small images, that means it can be trained with small images only. In addition, the training and inference can be very efficient. We compare our method with other state-of-the-art neural models. When tested on small images, if the whole size is not large, most neural models can achieve acceptable quality. However, if we increase the size of the whole or the size of the input image, the artifacts generated by other methods become severe, while our method performs consistently well. We also conducted the quantitative evaluation on all selected methods. We use four metrics to assess the quality of results. We use the inference time per image as an indication of efficiency. We test all methods on images of various size ranging from 512 all the way to 4K. When tested on small images as large as 512 by 512, our method achieves comparable quality as the best prior art, while the speed is slightly faster than other methods. When tested on 1K images, the quality achieved by other methods deteriorates significantly, while our method performs consistently well. In terms of the of the efficiency, our method is a lot of magnitude faster than other methods. When tested on 2K or 4K images, most prior arts cannot do the inference due to the limitation of GPU memory, while our method achieves constant quality and the inference time does not increase much. More test results on high resolution images are presented here. The model has been successfully deployed on Huawei's AI chip, Ascend 310. The codes and the converted models are available at the following link on GitHub.